If you're getting a login error in Marvel Rivals with a message which say unable to fetch account details with an error code 10, then in this tutorial, I will guide you on how to resolve this problem. Now, in most cases, this issue occurs due to network problems, but make sure to follow these instructions and I'll guide you step by step. Now, step one, make sure to accept the user agreement in Marvel Rivals. Now, the option usually appears in the top right corner when you launch the game. If the agreement hasn't been accepted, the game may block access and show the error code 10. This step has resolved the issue for many users, especially during the closed beta and the early, early access periods. Now, to accept the user agreement in Marvel Rivals is very easy. Just launch the Marvel Rivals game. Now, look for the user agreement or IOTA in the top right corner of the page after just launching Marvel Rivals. Now, click to accept or acknowledge the agreement. Restart the game and check if the error has been resolved. Now, if you've done so, but just still facing again the same issue, make sure to restart your device and router. Now, maybe if you're restarting your device, but just still facing again the same issue, try connecting to a different network, such as another Wi-Fi connection or using your phone's hotspot to test if this is a network-related issue. So, try connecting to a different network, such as another Wi-Fi connection or using your phone's hotspot to test if this is a network-related issue. Now, if you're on Xbox and you're facing this issue, make sure to follow this instruction. And if you're on PC, I'll also show you how to fix this. Now, let's start with Xbox. If Xbox just clear the saved data, Xbox games store saved game data in the cloud. Clearing it will allow the Xbox to resync with the game data. Additionally, if the saved data becomes corrupted, the game may fail to load properly, resulting in error codes like error code 10. As you sit here on this screenshot, which say unable to fetch account details, error code 10. Now, clearing local CFD data does not delete your progress permanently. Your data will be resynced from the cloud when you launch the game again. Now, to clear CFD data on your Xbox, just make sure to press the Xbox button, the glowing Xbox logo on your controller to open the guide menu. Navigate to Marvel Rivals in your recent games or my games and apps, then press X on your controller to open the options menu. Now select Manage Game and Add-ons from the drop-down options. Choose the Save Data tab second from the left. Select Delete All twice to confirm to clear all local Save Data from our variables. If you've cleared the Save Data, this should fix your issue. Now, if you want to PC, just try these instructions here. If you're connected to any VPN or proxy, make sure to disable any VPN or proxy. Also, reset your network. Now, to reset your network on PC, just press Window plus I to open your settings. Select here where it is written network and internet. Scroll down here where it is written advanced network settings. Click on it. Now scroll down here you'll see an option which say network reset. Click on it. Now select here reset now to reset your network and try to check if your issue has been resolved. Now, if you're still facing again the same issue, be sure to verify your game files. Now to verify your game files, open your games launcher. If you, for example, I'm using the Epic Games Launcher, so I'll open the Epic Games Launcher like this. Now click on the three dots for your game. Let's say this is your game, which is my rivals. Click on these three dots here. So I'll just click on the three dots. I'll click like this. Then go where it is written, manage. Now make sure to verify your game files here. Now this is try to check for any corrupted files and you try to repair it. After that, try to relaunch your game and your issue should be resolved. If you've done so, but just two first, again, the same issue. Just open Steam. So I'll open Steam like this. And go to your Steam library and make sure to add the game to Steam. So I'll select here, add a game. And make sure to add a non-Steam game. So make sure to click add a non-Steam game. And Steam will try to fetch for your game and try to add it on Steam. After that, right click on your game after it has been added. Go to properties. And make sure to go here to install files. And make sure to verify integrity of your game files. After that, your issue should be resolved. So make sure to follow this instruction very carefully. And I hope you'll be able to resolve this issue for unable to fetch account details in my arrivals.